Hey guys, Wells Knight here, and welcome back to another episode from the Hermitcraft server. And today we are here in the Orange District, in the Gaming District, and we are going to make ourselves a little bit of a mini game. Kind of, sort of. It's a game that is really kind of a classic, and I think it should actually be a lot of fun. So, what you may or may not know about me is that long ago, I used to be a really big fan of chess, and I thought it would be really cool to make a chess board <laughs> in Minecraft here on the server so that uh, the hermits can, well, play chess. <laughs> so that's what we're going to do. Um, the first thing is definitely going to be to get the board itself made, and I think we're going to do basically... Um, a combination of dark oak and bone blocks. I think those two will go really well for the chessboard. So, let's see. If we're facing this way, we need to start here because white on the right and a chessboard is eight blocks wide. So, about like that. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, right? So this would be our chessboard right here. And we can just put this whole thing down. And we'll kind of get this going. And I want it kind of up. Elevate. I may actually want to bring that up again. I may, I may want to bring this up a level. We'll see how this feels. And I may end up bringing it up one more Y level. Because uh, I do kind of want it up off the ground. So we'll go... So, oop, something... Wow, that got messed up. <laughs> Good job, me. Wow, I can't even... Uh, okay. We'll just pretend that didn't happen. Uh, Alright, so we'll get all of this filled in like so. And... There we go. So this would be our chessboard right here. Let's just fill that in. And that actually... That actually feels pretty good, because we'll have kind of a, an outer area where you can kind of stand up and see the whole board. Now, I've got a whole bunch of these banners, and I got these... Uh, there was a, a Reddit post quite a while ago. It's like over a year old. Uh, by a guy named Nightcrest. I will link it in the description if I remember. Um, but basically, uh, it's it's basically chess banners. So uh, that's what we're going to use here. And we're just going to put them all down like that. Those are our pawns. And then we'll have our rooks or castles here, depending on what you want to call them. These are the bishops, like that. We've got our knights, and then our queen and king. So, queen, well, yeah, I suppose this would be black, wouldn't it? Yeah, okay. So, and then these guys would be white, because they've got the white uh, pieces. So I'm thinking that's what we will do. So let's put down the rooks again, like so. Knights here and here. Bishop, bishop. Queen, this is the white queen, so it goes there, and there we go. So those are the actual chess pieces. Now we just need to take the board and make the board look pretty. So let's see, where did my ender chess go? Over here, here we go. So, there's a few things we can use here. I'm thinking, first and foremost, uh, let's actually grab out a crafting bench and go like that. And let's make some sandstone slabs. So, I'm thinking, first and foremost, I want a ring around the chessboard, kind of like this. Just a little bit of an elevation uh, change to kind of signify the edge of the board, right? 
So it'll look like that, and that seems... That seems good. Okay. Now here, kind of in the middle, and this is an even number, so it's going to be... It, this might end up being uh, seeming a little bit weird, but that's okay. I think right about here, we're going to come up about three high, like that. And then, hmm, now, do we want to go like this? Because I want to have, like, a little pedestal that you stand on, and you kind of look out and see everything that's going on. Uh, or you, you know, where you can see everything that's going on, I should say. So maybe, maybe here we would put dark oak like this? How does that look? Mm, it looks okay. I think it would look better if it were stairs. Maybe? Uh, so let's see, we would need eight dark oak stairs, and we'd go one... Ooh, that's gonna be really hard to place with the banner, isn't it? One, two, three, four, and then same kind of a deal like that. Yeah, that looks a little better. Okay, awesome. And then let's actually convert the rest of this into stairs because we're going to need, we've got this area here, but then we need a way to get up there. So we'll do probably stairs like this, and um, I guess we'll just do, yeah, sorry, Chess, you gotta move, you're in the way, that's okay. I'm thinking we'll just do something kinda like that, and then this will come up, oh, and there is a middle point, excellent. So we'll do probably something like this. Mm. Yeah, yeah, something like that. We'll fill in these back bits here with dark oak. Um, I'm going to throw one torch right here just to make this mob safe so we don't have annoying monster noises going on as you're playing. And that seems pretty good. And then we'll put stairs, I think, kind of going like this. Right? So that'll... Yeah, yeah, yeah. That looks good. Okay. And then you can see kind of the whole... Um, the whole field here. So you can run around and make informed decisions, shall we say. So let me get this done on the other side, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, I am back. So we've got the uh, little pedestal area things in place, which I think is good. Now, I'm also kind of thinking I want to do one more little thing. So let's grab four stairs, and I think I'm just going to put them right here like this, just to kind of... Um, accentuate that slope. I'm also thinking that this is going to have to be brought out a little bit, so I'll have to get some stained clay and do that, because you'll probably remember when we did the thing with Cub Fan, yeah, all of that is uh, hollow down there. So, we're going to have to... We'll, we'll deal with that. That's okay. Uh, in fact, how much of that do we... We, we don't need that much clay. Just a little bit. Hmm... I think it'll be fine. Okay, so let's go ahead next and make a handful of dark oak fences. I don't need many, just a couple. And we're going to go like this and like that. And then I'm going to put a torch here, here, and here. And that'll keep this all lit up. And we're actually going to need more dark oak fences than that, aren't we? Yep, that's okay. And there we go. That. One, two, yep, that should be enough. Okay, cool. 
So here, 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 and there. And then torches once again, like so. And that looks good. Now this, I'm not entirely sold on this right here. Uh, I've got these bone blocks down here, but I'm not really liking them. I don't think they mix very well with the sandstone. So I think, oh, I think we're going to change that. And I knocked a hole. We'll just put that right there. Um, I think we're going to change that out for something else. I think what we'll probably... Do, oh, there I go again. Oh, it's because I've got... The haste beacon is on. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Um, let me go and get some stained clay so I can fill in these holes. And then I also need to kind of extend this little area right here out a bit. Uh, so let me get some stained clay, and I'll come back and do that, and then we'll, uh, we'll see what we can work out for this. Alright guys, I am back, and I'm thinking we're gonna use oak stairs, assuming I have enough of them. And I think I, it, it looks like I will. Uh, so we're gonna go and just basically wrap the whole thing with these oak stairs instead. And I think that'll look alright. Hopefully we'll have enough stairs. I think we will. Yeah. Yeah, we do. Just barely, though. That was actually pretty close. Uh, so, there we go. We've got ourselves the chessboard all pretty much ready to go. I think it might be beneficial to stick a little bit of glowstone in a couple spots. Maybe... Mm, I'm not liking that, though. Maybe we'll stick it right here? No, that looks terrible. I wish... We need to find a spot where we can hide... Oh. Oh, that's an issue down there, too. Um... Hmm. What do we want to do down there? Maybe... Boy, I don't know on that. What do we want to do there? Do we have... We should have enough dark oak that I can just sneak a little bit of it down here. Yeah, I think that'll work. These uh, these dark oak logs. I mean, there we go. Because we, we definitely want to cover that up. Okay. And then maybe... Hmm. I mean, this board really isn't going to be mob safe. So... I think it'll I think it'll probably be okay. As is. Let's just see. I mean, you can really see everything from here. And you can see everything from over here. So I think that's pretty much good. There's really oh, now I'm breaking things that I don't want to be breaking. Let's get rid of all these banners, though, because what I want to do is I actually, I was I was thinking about it while I was gathering some of that uh, hardened clay, and I think what I want to do is I actually want to go ahead and name the banners, whatever the name of the piece is, so that way there's no confusion as to, you know, what pieces are what and all that kind of stuff. I, I want it to all, it'll, I think it'll make more sense if we actually name uh, the banners. So, let's grab all of those guys up. We can grab this. And... I think we got room for that. Yes, we do. Good. Okay. So, let me run... Oh, yeah. And this actually looks pretty good. This isn't bad. For a little... A little chess area. I think it works. I might... Hmm... I don't know about the sandstone. No, the sandstone fits. It fits. It's fine. Okay. So anyway, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to run to the Ender Ender, and I'm going to get myself some uh, some experience so I can name these banners and name them all the proper thing, and I'll come back to you in just a minute. All right, guys. I am back, and I've... Oh, hi, baby zombie. I'm, I'm back, and I'm getting interrupted. Wow. Uh, anyway... So, we've got the White Queen, and we've got the White King. 
Oh, but if you break them, they don't... Oh, I forgot that they lose their name. Well, that was a derp. <laughs> I just spent all that time naming the banners. And then... Oh, man. I can't believe I did that. And I'm getting attacked from everywhere. Where are, th where are these guys spawning? Like, I th we have almost this whole thing lit up. Light. Lights everywhere. Just, yes. <laughs> oh, man. This place is dangerous at night. We need... We need a little bit more lighting in here. I think we need some lighting here, and here, and here. And... Hopefully... That will be adequate. I don't think there are any more areas that I should be really worried about. I think that's pretty much everything that's spawnable. At least as far as I can tell. Maybe over here? That might be a spawnable area. But I think for the most part this should be this should be okay. Uh, let's put a torch here as well. Just in case. We'll torch some of that up too. Uh, anyway. So... As I was saying before I was so rudely interrupted by all the zombies. We'll get our banners in place. Uh, we'll put white on this side. Uh, night here and here. And you can kind of see the banners. I think they work pretty well, honestly. I think, I think it's relatively obvious what they are, especially if you've played chess before. Uh, and obviously they match, so... Um, you know, the, the designs are the same for each side. They're just reversed. So let's put this stuff in place. There we go. And then we put these banners down as well. And I think, I think that should do it. So there we have it, guys. We made ourselves a bit of a chessboard, which hopefully will get used. I'm totally down for chess. I've actually, I used to play a lot of chess. Back in the day, uh, I haven't played now for quite a long time, but I think I think I, I could still probably manage. It's been a very long time since I've played, but uh, you know, it's like it's like riding a bike. You never really forget how to play chess. I don't think so. We'll see. Maybe maybe one of the hermits will challenge me to a chess match. That could be fun. Uh, <laughs> but anyway, guys, that is gonna do it for this episode. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. I do appreciate it and it really helps out my channel. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch. There are links in the video description below, so check that out as well. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll definitely see you next time.